First, launch Studio One. On the Startup page, click Configure External Devices. Click Add. I happen to be using an Akai Synth Station 25. It's not including the pre-configured device templates for Akai. Not to worry, we'll create our own custom entry. At the top, click New Keyboard. Here, I'm going to type Akai for Manufacturer. Synth Station 25 is the model name. Most importantly, the Receive From setting must be set to the correct MIDI input device. Check with your MIDI device manufacturer's website for the latest driver. If the driver is corrupted or not installed, or if your MIDI device is not physically connected to the computer, Studio One will not see the device in the list. We're going to create a new song and show how to make a simple MIDI recording. In the Instruments browser on the right, choose a sound. I'm going to choose the clavinet sound for the PreSonus Mojito device. Anyone running artist, producer, or professional versions of Studio One should have this sound. Click, hold, and drag the clavinet into the project space. Hit the record button and play an idea on your MIDI controller. You should be hearing sound from your configured audio device output while visually confirming the MIDI events in the software window. Double click on the MIDI event that was just recorded. Now we're entering what we refer to as edit mode. Let's play back what was just recorded. In the edit window, you can see that the MIDI notes are triggering the clavinet sound. Now you can edit the MIDI data however you creatively desire. 